Hey, Carolina Tony, coming to you today from Musgrove Mills near Clinton, South Carolina. And this is the site of where a revolutionary battle was fought where a small number of militia warded off large bands of English invaders. And anyway, there's a neat waterfall here, as you can see over my shoulder. Side of an old grist mill and all kinds of other things to see. But for right now, let's go take a look. On August the 19th, 1780, a small battle-tested band of the state militia fought a larger loyalist force comprised of both militia and British provincial soldiers at what became to be called the Battle of Musgrove's Mill. And this was where they used a guerrilla type of war warfare that... Uh, Hadn't really been used a whole lot during the Revolutionary War. Here's a portion of a letter that was written to William Henry Drayton uh, from Edward Musgrove, talking about how he wanted to remain neutral in this new Revolutionary War. The letter excerpt read, So you see, I have interfered on either side only so far as you might have expected from me, which I would not have come short of by any means. If I was to undertake, I would be very sorry to fail in the matters. Therefore, it is wisdom to balance everything in the right scale. How's that for splitting events? Okay, within well this split rail fence are the ruins of that actual house. There were the steps. And this is all that's left of it. So the Battle of Musgrove Mill would have been fought right here on this property in the late 1700s. And now people come up today, as this is a state park, to picnic and hike and just hang out with family and friends near Clinton, South Carolina and play ye old game of Revolutionary War Cornhole and it's said that he was buried right where he was killed 1780. Here's a trail that leads along beside the river. Just to get to a different spot. This is the site where Musgrove Mill would have been because there's not much left to it. The uh, state archaeologists had come in and dug and uncovered and she said that it was now covered up with about eight foot of earth from where it was actually originally. You see the ducks See if I can zoom in. Out there in the middle and the turtles. Good spot to take a dip. And this looks like where a bridge would have been once over the river. And those are very old stones piled up there. Here's the 
the bridge piers from a different site and some of the old pilings over there. And more turtles out there. Taking a dip. The car sunning off into sun. Well, that about does it with our visit to Musgrove Mill near Clinton, South Carolina. Sitting here on the edge of a bridge overlooking this little river and waterfalls. But for now, y'all have a good day.